Hi guys, welcome back to my video. My name is Jade Dragon, also known as Haley, and today's video is what vibe do you give off to other people? So we have pile number one, pile number two, pile number three, <clears throat> and pile number four. So go ahead and pick your pile down below. I guess I'll just keep them here. So, hello, if you chose pile number one, the emperor card, then this is what people think of you or like the vibe you give off. So we have the emperor, the page of wands, and the page of cups. <clears throat> so, people see you as a very grounded individual who is kind of in their own world. I feel like you guys are always either planning something or making a list or um working or enjoying an activity i feel like you're um i just heard popular loner so you may be by yourself a lot but people do know you know of you i feel like people think that you're beautiful you might keep your hair up um in buns or ponytails you um i heard like the buns definitely but you could also be a Taurus. um or a water sign. I feel like what the vibe you give off to other people is that you're headed like certain places in life. That you have enthusiasm, that you have youth, and that you have vision and determination. And that you will get there. And that you have like self-respect for yourself. You hold your head high and your shoulders back. And I feel like you guys won't take, you know, no for an answer or, um... Like, you won't take less than you deserve in any relationship or a business partnership or whatever. I feel like you guys could also be spiritual or connected with nature or traveling um, or fashion or some kind of materialistic, not materialistic, but like earthly matter. I don't know. But like I just heard ice sculpting or artists. Y'all could be artists on the side. But I feel like also I'm getting like director vibes. Y'all could be creative directors or um, managers or, <clears throat> you know, some sort of vision person who has leadership and communication skills. Yeah. I feel like you dress kind of in a manly fashion. Like, like you could be a girl and have like kind of a tomboy fashion. Um... Yeah, you could have freckles, but I feel like people just notice the vibe that you give off is kind of like, I'm not going to say like a resting bitch face, but like you're just kind of like um, hard to get to. You may not like approach other people right away. So what's the vibe that pile number one gives off? I just heard royalty, um, business person. What's the vibe that they get off here? The page of swords. So you got a lot of pages here. So y'all could be in your 20s or you could be a teenager. People may think that you're young, that you have a lot of ideas um, that you're still working on, that you're still thinking about. You may not be quite as confident as you need to be right now. People may be thinking, you know, you really need to put yourself out there or you need to go for it. Or like, um, you need to, I mean, like, finish what you start or something. You know? Yeah, like, you need to complete some sort of project. Um, or like, don't say something and then, you know, not do it. Like, make sure you're doing what you say you're going to do. Yeah, the lover's card as well. I feel like um, a lot of people do love you. A lot of people see you as a good, um, stable person to be in a relationship with or something like that, you know? <clears throat> One more. Yeah, I feel like or someone has a crush on you and wants to... These people want to start a relationship with you or want to have a kind of emotional connection with you. Yeah, because they feel like you would be a great wife, a great um, support system. But that is your reading or you're not a husband if you're a man. But I 
much for reading. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, a like down below, and a comment. Hello, if you chose this pile, this is pile number two. Then this is what vibe you give off to others. We have the Ace of Wands, the Hierophant, and the Five of Wands. So I just heard Sagittarius and Scorpio, um, Taurus, Capricorn, Cancer. Alright, um, <clears throat> Libra. I mean, you guys are very beautiful to the eye. Very, very beautiful to the eye. Um, people love to look at you. They love your fashion sense or they love um the way you do your makeup the way you do your hair the way you do your jewelry your outfits um people just love to look at you like a guardian of roses y'all um also your nails could be done like all the time or your um toes could always be done painted i feel like you guys are very like masculine energy but you could be a female but i feel like you're very um very knowledgeable very smart you could have went to college um or you could be a mom but you're very, very wise and very smart. And people look up to you and respect you as a person. And I feel like a lot of people may actually try to argue with you. And you shut that shit down real quick is what I'm hearing. Or um, you may just be a very argumentative person and be like very like my way or the highway type of vibe. I feel like people get um, the energy that you might clash with them or that you may, um, I don't know, I'm hearing like, you may be very feisty. What what is the goal? What is the vibe? The vibe. What is the vibe? You might have an accent, is what I'm hearing. You may be very foreign, or people think that you're foreign. Or that your um your second language is English, or that you know you speak Italian or you speak um French or um German. Eight of Wands, yeah, you guys could be very fast moving, very on the move, very smart, very go getter, very hustler energy, um, and very like self made, self paid, self independent. I feel like you guys, yeah, you don't need anybody. You may have moved from a country all by yourself, um, to America, or you may have, um, traveled all by yourself across the country before, or just you know you've just done a lot of stuff by yourself and i feel like you know that you're the only person you really need yeah to financially yeah you know you can always financially take care of yourself and i feel like people this is the vibe they get from you is that you're a strong independent person who doesn't need nothing from nobody and that you know what you're doing and that you're gonna get your bread and yeah i just feel like you're also kind of mysterious to people um, people think they're wondering like what you're doing, you know, what are you up to, how many jobs do you have. Um, yeah, they may judge you um based off your appearance and think that you're like a stripper or that you're cheating or um something like this. But yeah, because you're so beautiful. Power number um two whoever you are you're so very beautiful and you attract things to you and you're a beautiful manifester and you also may have children um i think i already said that but yeah people see you as a giver uh, um or a mother um or some kind of person who takes care of people who you love and doesn't deal with the bs like your kind of protector energy leader energy you may be the savior in your family but um, people really respect you and they really love you and they really want to be with you. Or, but I feel like you could be single right now or you could be committed to somebody. Yeah. yeah, I feel like you guys don't mess with no immature people. But that's your vibe. I hope y'all are hearing grown ass women. Um, but I hope you guys like your video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, like, comment down below. <coughs> Hello, if you chose this pile, this is a group number three. This is the vibe you give off. So, we got the King of Pentacles, the Seven of Cups, and the Sun. So, people definitely think that you're well off, that you're very happy, that you don't have a care in the world. Um, people may think that you're a player because you have money, because you have good looks, or because you have stability. They may think that you have options. <clears throat> They may think that you're very happy. Um, I don't know if this is the case. You know, who knows? 
but it does appear that you are to be or are very abundant and happy. You may be a lawyer, I'm hearing, or some kind of business person, a doctor. Yeah, the high priestess. Um, so people think that you're very smart. They see you as someone to go for advice to. Um, you also may be married, I'm hearing. You may be married and people think that you may cheat on your marriage or something like that. Um, because you're so good looking or something or because you have so much money. But I feel like you're not. I feel like, yeah, I feel like you stand up for yourself. Um, I feel like you do what you want, but you know, like it doesn't mean you do what everybody thinks you're doing. I feel like you don't let the haters get to you. You, even though a bunch of people try to poke at you, I feel like you just do your own thing. Yeah, the Ace of Cups. I feel like you guys are self, um, very self-accepting, very loving of self. Or, like, you stay in your own little world. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people see you, though. Maybe you're, like, famous on, um, on the internet and people think that you're so well off. Or they make all these comments that don't even know you and you're like, oh, whatever, you know. But you're still watching me, right? And I feel like you guys are just planning for the next thing. You may be working on your career or the next step. You know, working or collaborating with more people um, <clears throat> around the world. Y'all may be travelers. You may want to go live in a different country or in a different state. Or go meet somebody. I feel like y'all want to meet somebody. Or you have met somebody online or something. Yeah. But I feel like you guys are more like, like people, you're, people assume that you're like mean or something or like something like this. And really you're like a really nice person, um, a very loving person who's just minding their own business. Um, maybe people you've rejected or something like this or like just outsiders may think, you know, differently of you, but it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I feel like you guys are minding your own business, like, literally. And people are just, like, out, outside looking in, like, wondering what the heck is going on, making assumptions. You know, so it doesn't even really matter, right? <laughs> but that's your reading. I oh, hope you guys like it. I just heard it's not easy here on the top. It's not easier on the top. It's lonely on the top. That's what I just heard. So, <clears throat> I hope you guys like that reading. And I just heard more money, more problems. <laughs> So I hope y'all like your reading. If you did, please give it a like down below, subscribe, and comment. Hi guys, if you took this last reading, the Six of Cups, Temperance, and the I was about to say the Lovers, but it's the Two Cups. This is what people love. Oh my God, I was gonna say love about you. People love y'all, by the way. But this is what people, the vibe that you give off. So first off. People think that you're hilarious or that you're very patient and calm and loving with them. You may also be a mother um, or a sibling or you may take care. You may take care of your siblings um, or, you know, elderlies or something. I don't know what you do, but I feel like y'all are best friends with everybody or you don't have a problem with everybody. You're not the problem is what I mean. Y'all are very chill, very blessed, very blessing. Um... I feel like y'all could be a babysitter, y'all could be a, a teacher, a caregiver, um, someone who works with children or with um, elderly people or disabled people or or um, volunteers or does non-profit, you know, somebody who does gives their time to the universe to people who need it, um, you know, like maybe lit work at a shelter animal shelter or a homeless shelter or um you just don't do you know like i feel like y'all y'all understand your abundant y'all understand that you don't know, not need everything in the world that like you give a little bit you get a little bit is what i'm hearing you know and things go 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 what goes around comes around that's so funny um i feel like you guys definitely put relationships and funny and love and laughter you know above money above all that and so i feel like spirit definitely blesses you with uh good luck with abundance with happiness with um family 
Yeah, I feel like with money too. Like, um, some people may want to take care of you. Some people may feel like, yeah, like, oh my god, this person is so great. I just want to take care of them. Um, you guys may not even feel like you want this, you know. Maybe so, like, um, so giving, so uh, selfless, you know. But what is the vibe that Pound number three gives off? What is the vibe? What is Pound number three's vibe? Three of Wands. Y'all might be moving or looking forward to something soon. Looking forward to a birthday. But yeah, I'm getting moving. Y'all might be moving soon. Looking forward to, um, y'all may just have got out of a relationship, um, with somebody or had a heartbreak or something. Um, I just heard someone's house may have burned down. I'm so sorry if that happened to you. I'm so, so, so sorry if that happened. But what, um, how do people perceive or what is the vibe that Final Big Secrets are? What is their vibe? I'm hearing whatever happens, you will always be okay with this um three in, a swords in Natalia you guys will always come out victorious you'll always work up your way you'll always you know <laughs> stand on your two feet and get up and all that like some people just um lie around feel bad for themselves you know but I feel like you guys are very smart individuals very um go-getter you know but not too much like I feel like you guys are very connected to what you truly want, you know. But yeah, what a very strong individual here. What is the perception? The nine of cups that people think you're happy. People think that you might have a lot going on, or that it might be hard for you, but that you're strong and that you always, you know, make it through. Yeah, and now you may have people who love you who want to support you, but you may say no, no, no. No, no, no. Everything's okay. I'll be okay. Yeah, I feel like you guys are very hard workers. And you work hard, you play hard. And, you know, you have boundaries. You may have a, a significant other. Or you guys are very strong. You work together. Um, You could both be air signs. <laughs> but, yeah. This is your reading. I hope y'all like it. I hope you... Um, I just heard peacemaker, calm. Y'all may be very like calm where you don't, you know, you only speak when you, when it's funny or when it's nice or when you need to. Like, you're not going to go and complain. I feel like you guys understand, you know, emotional intelligence and um, perseverance and resilience. I feel like y'all might be married and you understand, you know, um, communication and being nice and not always saying every rude thing you think of, you know. But I feel like you guys are very peaceful, very um, loving and caring. You may have kids as well. I feel like I'm picking up on a lot of people who have kids in this reading. But um, it's beautiful. I want kids in the future. I'm definitely going to have kids. So, you know. Anyway, I hope you guys like the video and comment down below and like and subscribe.